Hello student. Today our topic is spark ignition engines. Spark ignition engine. In a four stroke petrol engine or spark ignition engines, all the events of the cycle, suction, compression, expansion, and exhaust take place in a two revolution of a crankshaft. Seven twenty degree Celsius of crankshaft rotation. Thus, each stroke is of 180 degree crankshaft rotation. Therefore, cycle of the operation for an idle four stroke engine consists of the four strokes. The first is induction or suction stroke. Second is compression stroke. Third is expansion or working or power stroke. Fourth is exhaust stroke. The first is exhaust stroke. During this exhaust this stroke the pistons moves downward the pistons this piston is moves downward by the crankshaft from tdc top dead center to bottom dead center position the crankshaft is initially revolved either by the power generation the electric start motor or by the movement of a flywheel the inlet valve open there is a inlet valve in the suction stroke the inlet valve is open open and the exhaust valve remain closed the movement of the piston increase the space thereby re reducing the pressure in the cylinder the high pressure of the outside as atmosphere forces the charge air fuel mixture through the inlet valve into the cylinder into the cylinder the operation continues till the piston reach the bdc bottom dead center position where the inlet valve close during this period the crankshaft rotates through through 180 degree half revolution then next stroke is begin compression stroke during this stroke the piston moves from bdc bottom dead center to tdc top dead center and the both valves are closed the upward movement of the piston compresses the charge drawn during suction stroke due to the compression the pressure and the temperature of the mixture increases continuously and depends upon the compression ratio when the piston is just reaching the end of the compression stroke the spark occurs and the charge is ignited this is the spark plug ignite at constant volume the chemical energy of the fuel is converted into heat energy producing high temperature of about 1800 to 2000 degree celsius and pressure is also increased then next stroke power stroke this increase high pressure of combustion exert a greater amount of force on the piston and the push it downward from tdc top dead center to bottom dead center position with both the valve closed this is the only stroke during which power is produced and thus it is named as power stroke working stroke when the piston reach bdc bottom dead center the exhaust valve open and the pressure falls to slightly above the atmospheric pressure at constant volume the next stroke is exhaust stroke during the exhaust stroke the exhaust valve open and the inlet valve remain closed there is a inlet valve closed and the exhaust valve is now open pressure of the burnt gas is slightly above the atmospheric pressure and the pistons move from bdc to tdc position the upward movement of the piston push out the exhaust gases through the exhaust valve or exhaust port into the atmosphere and the next cycle start it is a spark plug ignition working inlet air enters from the inlet valve now compression and third is the power stroke now piston move bdc and the fourth is exhaust piston move bdc to tdc and the cycles continuously running thanks